airsaw. Here's what you need. A holster of some sort. I made this one myself so I can not that hard to do. All you need is a knife and tape and uh, cardboard. Throw some scissors, felt. This isn't my camo thing right here, but um, I have this on right because I can put on my helmet. This is, I'd say, the best helmet. The best gun right here. See my AK. Got real wood and working pipes, which I'm call it. The best top up. Best top up in the game. Um, magazine holds fire in your 50 rounds. Best magazine release because it's, it's like this. Right, so that you can pull it out and stuff. Um, 40 to 55 millimeter barrel stock, like it's already in there. Uh, three extra batteries. Uh, I have like a water thing with a bob right here, like this. See this thing? Works great. Um, I use GNG 0.28. It says PSBP, but it's just. GNG. It doesn't say like the brand on it for some reason. This, this is like kind of the perfect spherical ball pellet. Like it's like Chinese. Looks like it's a GNG logo on this one. They do advertise the GNG guns though. This is CM16 right here. So, yeah. These are 0.28 grade BBs. These are about as good as BBs get right here for the price. Like, um, if you actually want to run on a budget, these are good, good, BB, good BBs. Like you don't spend any more than you do with like .20s because with .20s people don't call their hits past like 150, 100, not 175 feet, pretty much, because you can't feel BBs out to that distance. Yeah, the .20s you can't feel .20s at that distance. Um, get yourself some some nice shoes. And by shoes I mean boots. Um, um, right here. Just gonna the right there. See them? There they are. Um, so the reason why you need to use these is because you only need to use one magazine. You just bring one mag, one high cap. No, no chest rig, nothing. So you bring one high cap and you just like double tap people. So you go, one of them hits them and then the crowd is like, oh, what just happened here? They maybe you hit them like three, four times. You know, you don't need to shoot that much. Because um, it's great BBs. Um, gotta get yourself some lubricant like this. Works great. I forgot what the use for it was. What was it? See, what do you use this shit for? Oh yeah, hop up unit. You know. Gotta what do you, need? you maintain it. So that shit works. This is my helmet right here. Let me show you. Let me show you. Let me show you its features. See, on the inside, I put this little thing on here. This is what I was going to show you guys in a different video, but I just gave up on that one. See that little thing right there? So this is like if the fragments from the BBs come through this thing, it's going to do that. And if you don't wear glasses, you could just wear like some sunglasses under it or something. Clear ballistic glasses for like shooting or something. And if you have one that's a little bit too big, like, like one of these helmets are too big and you... You, you did like that, you just put one of these on. Increases your head size by a lot. Works very well. And that is how you put it on. This is all you need to do to uh, play airsoft. This is all your gear. This is, this is all you need. Get yourself a gun, get yourself a sidearm. For me, it's a SEMA AEP. Uh, these things are pretty much drop, drop proof. Last longer than gla gas blow backs. Don't need any maintenance whatsoever. Got full auto, 30 round magazine. Let me whip this thing out. I did a review on it. I'll link it to you guys. Um, I use two O's in it. I, I honestly I use like Thunder BBs, which are like 12 bucks for like 5,000 or something. And it's on Amazon. Also, I don't see buy. I don't see buy from Amazon because um, the guy who oh, uh, owns it, he, he's he's a uh, he's like anti-Trump and he did something. I forgot what he did, but it's pretty bad. So this kind of looks bad, I guess. I know it does, but um, I just need to put some camo camouflage tape on it. Some camo tape on uh, this belt too, right here. Done.
So, uh, yeah, you know, it's like getting air stuff. And um, the, the reason why uh, JKs are good. Not another thing, we got the Burn 3 gearbox, so that's pretty much draw for it. Um, fucking cheap as shit. Got mine for 138 that's with shipping, by the way. I actually saw a deal on Airsoft Megastore that was going down to 134 So, uh, yeah, this is not what it looks like when it comes out of the thing. Now I'll give you a good angle of it. Here. Look at that good angle of it. It's a pretty good gun. So my idea some stuff to it. I'm not telling you my, my secret, it's just range. But it's, uh, it hits like 240 feet. And yeah, I can get hit that for those distances. Um, that's, about, that's literally all you need to wear. Or in cold weather, you just put other, other stuff on there. I, I don't recommend vests because um, you use one mid cap and point two eight, so you don't need to use a lot of rounds. You don't go through, you, I don't even go through like a third of this shit in like one game. I don't. Probably like a, a fifth in one game. Maybe even a sixth if I'm lucky. If I don't get any kills, it's, it's like... Like, like an eighth. There's nothing. Um, and when you have this one mid cap, you don't need like a big chest rig kind of thing. I have this. You don't need to bring one of these. You don't need it. Also, I'd recommend this specific CMO48 line because it comes with an M120 spring and it's pre installed. And that's for 138 138 bucks. On not Amazon, on the Bear Sub Mega Store. I'll promote that company. I did some stuff to it. It doesn't, it doesn't look like out of the box. It doesn't look as dope as my out of the box. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, fun stuff. I look like an idiot. I look like a, a pope from the future. I wear this, but, um. I put Velcro on it. See? See the Velcro? See it? You good Velcro? That's good Velcro. I don't wear I don't wear these clothes out to the airsoft field. I trust me, I have some camo in my closet. See my camis? Some camis? I wear some camis. Oh yeah, another thing, get some camo. Like this. Or this. Or this. And get a camo uh, shirt that's actually like, breathable. Like uh, one of these like nylon ones. Ah! I can't find it. I can't find it. Where is it at? There it is. These, these are good. So here's the guy we get in there itself, guys. That's what I did. It's all minimalism. So you got 138 right here. It's the rifle. Magazine is stock. Don't need to buy shit for it. Don't buy any red dots. Don't need that. Iron sights are a okay. They work. Iron sights work. Red dots are cool, I guess, but they cover up your BBs. Like, you can't really see where your BBs are going with them. Hey, eight fours, nine sixes, those both work. Don't get lipos, because then you need to get a pet cycle charger for it. And there, there, and they suck. The BBs, these are like 17 bucks for 2750 Trust me, you will not go through these. It's at, these are like two years old, man. These bags, I got them like two years ago. I shit you not. I shit you not. Not like two years ago. It's probably like six, seven months ago. I don't play a lot of airsoft that much. This is mostly for my shooting and like my backyard and stuff. So it's like 90% of it. Um, helmet, or like just under 40 bucks. Best thing you will ever buy, trust me. The best. Guaranteed the best. That shirt, like 11 bucks in LA, like Walmart. You can get this stuff for cheaper prices, like on, on the eBay, you can get some stuff for cheaper. eBay is also anti Trump, so I wouldn't really recommend it. If you're actually willing to buy this AP, it's basically like 60 bucks on Amazon. Not Amazon, uh, eBay. Right here. SEMA CM122. Um, One point seven pounds, I guess. So it's kind of heavy. You modify it like that. So um, yeah, I guess that's how it works. I guess. I got okay. I got okay. I got I got to do some stuff with this because like this looks bad. Uh, two two hundred ten out of the box. 
of the FPS of it. 15 rounds per second. Uh, it's a fucking gun that does things. See, that's the wear marks on it. It's worn down. Now it's just like staples inside my holster. So uh, this is what it looks like, guys. This is very soft. This is very soft. Some dumb shorts and some flip-flops. Oh, don't wear flip-flops on airsoft, you'll trust me. They got like nettles and shit everywhere. and every, Like all the plants are cup thorns. At least wear shoes. At least. Boots. Optimum. 100% best. Maybe rubber boots. Rubber boots are great too. I, I have never seen them in airsoft. Never uh, seen them in use. I assume they're cheap too, but um, yeah. Don't look over there. This is like some old stuff from like 2015. I was, I was like two years younger than this. So I was like 15, 14, 15. No, 15, 16 when I did this kind of shit. It was dumb. I was dumb to like some armor stuff. Don't, don't do that. Do not do that. Don't you don't need to wear anything. BBs do not hurt that bad. Okay, trust me, they do not hurt. They really do not hurt. All right. Maybe they'll sting for a second at worst. At super close range, you straight up don't really feel it. Like you're like, oh, it kind of hurts. Ow, oh, ow. Oh. It's, it's like, oh, it's, it's like it's like five seconds, man. Five seconds of ow. Uh, what else is there? I feel like I'm missing something. Oh yeah, rails. You don't need rails. That's, that's why I, I want to tell you guys. Put some shit on your gun, doesn't do anything. It just increases its weight. This thing handles fine without a without a Picatinny rail with a with a hand grip on it. I mean, my dad's got an M4. It's it's, it's not M4. M16A A4. It's got all this shit on it. Um, yeah, this is the gun. This is the.